everyone, today in this video, I'm gonna be checking out the Lexar Armor 700 portable SSD. Lexar did send me the sample, but any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this portable drive or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. You'll notice that the sample size they sent me here is two terabytes, but there are multiple storage capacities and versions available. Retail box and packaging has front and center the performance of this drive, 2000 megabytes per second read speeds and 2000 megabytes per second write speeds. They have system requirements on the side too. So this will work with Windows, Mac, Android and iPhone 15 series devices. So make sure to check your iPhone 15 model to see if it'll work for you. So this is IP66 rated and it's three meter drop tested as well too. So we have some solid durability with this particular drive. And what's really cool is they have a nice breakout of the dimensions on the side of the box as well. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and see what's inside. Here are all the contents. First up, we have our product literature here with system requirements and warranty information. All this info is available in multiple languages in this guide. This does come with a five year warranty. Next, you'll see an included USB type C cable to USB type A with a removable adapter to USB type C. So type C to type C or type C to type A, it's up to you. And then last, but definitely not least, we have the drive itself. Let's pop off that plastic cover there. I really like this color of the drive. It's kind of got a blue hue to it. Lexar logo and branding front and center. Take a look at the back side here, Armor 700. Other side, here's a look at the very top. We have our capacity and model information right there. And on the bottom, we have our USB type C port. Really sleek and slick drive here. I like what I'm seeing. Now let's go ahead, let's plug it in and try it out. First up, when you plug in the drive, you'll be greeted to a couple files already on the drive. So we have Lexars. This is their Disk Shield software. If you wanna take advantage of that to protect your data, they have everything you need to get started right here on the drive itself. You can access some PDF guides and they actually have the file folder and application for you to get up and running. I also went ahead and opened up the drive properties so you could see 50 megabytes currently in use for those files and we still have 1.86 terabytes left of usable free space on this drive. Now let's see how fast it is. First up, let's look at our crystal disk mark results. We got 2,011 megabytes per second read speed. So we actually exceeded what they advertised, which is always great to see. In regards to write speeds, we clocked 1,809 megabytes per second. So we are below the 2,000 megabytes per second that they advertised. Moving on over to ASSSD, we never see as high results with this test. And as expected, we are below our crystal disk mark results. 1683 for our read speed and 1541 for our write speed. Everything's still very respectable here. Hopefully you're seeing similar, if not better results on your system. Just make sure you're connected to the correct USB port. This is USB 3.2 Gen 2 by 2. So in our case, our USB port has the SS USB icon and a 20 next to it. That's what you're gonna wanna see on your system to get similar, if not better results than what you're seeing here in our video. So we exceeded the advertised read speed and we just came up a little bit shy on the advertised write speed. Everything is well within range though and it's totally acceptable for this particular portable SSD. And depending on your usage scenario and environment, you'll appreciate having that rugged durability rating as well too with the drive that's this capable. So it's small, it's compact, it's durable, and it's pretty, pretty fast for what it is. 